Tela stands for Science and Theory Enabling Intelligent Laser Manufacturing and is composed of one flagship and two basic foundational research projects within the framework of MexQLib. We develop cyber physical system or CPS laser manufacturing capable of proposing the optimal processing parameters based on simulation in cyberspace. STELLA is a network of about 100 researchers from the University of Tokyo and eight other institutions. One joint flagship and four basic foundation research projects are being carried out for the next generation laser technological area. The flagship is Advanced Laser Innovation Center, or ARIS, and composed of two divisions. The one is STELLA, and the other is at second lasers for next frontiers in science and technology. I worked in Europe for a relatively long time, but STELLA is a really unique endeavor to understand and simulate all the elements of laser processing comprehensively. I expect that the nationwide network will not only revolutionize smart laser manufacturing, but also advance the whole photon science and laser technology and contribute to human capacity building. Laser processing is flexible with many parameters such as wavelengths, pulse duration, and pulse energy. Today, these parameters are optimized by human experience and intuition to meet the mass customization need in the coming Super Smart Society 5.0. We want to replace them with approaches driven by data, artificial intelligence, and science and theory that highly integrate cyberspace and physical space or CPS. We turn cycles of trial with various laser parameters, database building, operando measurements and theoretical investigations, and prediction by artificial intelligence and science and theory simulations. We have developed an ultra-fast single-shot image method called STAMP. It allows us to obtain the movies of various dynamical events in laser manufacturing, such as early stage light matter interaction, plasma generation and evolution, and thermal and structural events of materials in the time scales from a nanosecond to femtosecond. For example, we achieved to observe the changes in the distribution of electron density in ultra-fast laser processing. By combining STAMP and the conventional high-speed camera, we have also monitored plasma dynamics in all the processing pulses. Our STAMP provides opportunities to reveal ultra-fast processes in laser manufacturing and also to collect a massive amount of image data at high speed. It contributes to the growth of data-driven CPS laser manufacturing, as well as three-driven CPS laser manufacturing. My group is developing optical spectroscopy and microscopy techniques, in particular, high-speed spectrometers and multimodal microscopes. For example, we have recently developed the world's fastest vibrational spectrometer that allows us to measure rapidly changing phenomena. We also invented a bond-selective quantitative phase microscope that gives vibrational and morphological dual-model imaging contrast. With our new measurement techniques, we are going to answer the fundamental questions, for example, why we can make higher quality laser processing with ultra short pulses. We have developed theories based on density function theory for energy absorption caused by laser initiation. We are creating a database that stores the energy absorption with given laser parameters. Our trained AI will handle the database instead of us. We found prominent anisotropy of energy absorption by our nonlinear optical process in crystals. It is expected that efficiency optimization of the laser processes in the cyberspace. To realize CPS laser manufacturing, Stella closely collaborates with other national projects. NEDO Takumi project mainly focuses on laser source and database, while SIP CPS project integrates the fruits of Takumi and Stella projects into a system. We have established a laser processing platform that contributes to solving problems in laser processing. Users can easily use the state-of-the-art laser light source and laser processing machines developed in our NEDO Takumi project. These equipments are combined with measurement and evaluation technologies, as well as database. Complementary to a theoretical approach, 
an artificial intelligence AI approach, such as deep learning, could be effective in realizing a near-term practical simulator. Automated acquisition of high-quality and large database is essential for the effective use of neural networks. In 2013, we started the next project called the Innovative Center for Coherent Photon Technology and or the ICCPT. Our goal is to realize comfortable, personalized lifestyles by coherent photon technology. Then, in 2017, we have founded the University of Tokyo Research Institute for Photon Science and Laser Technology, also known as UTRIPL. Now, UTRIPL is coordinating different big projects, including the ICCPT, TACMI project, CPS project, and the STEL to achieve synergy for realizing CPS laser manufacturing and the super smart society. CPS laser manufacturing is a key to smart manufacturing of semiconductor and electronic parts, leading to digital transformation, augmenting the use of high performance computers, artificial intelligence, big data, which in turn accelerates CPS. Then CPS spreads from manufacturing to mobility, energy, and other fields. And finally, leads to realizing Super Smart Society 5.0.